Hello everybody, this is Luke and welcome back to Gaming Instincts TV and our How to Slay series for Monster Hunter World. Patrolling the skies of the Coral Highlands is the elegant Legiana. This icy monster is swift on its wings and does not stay in one spot for long, so here are some tips and tricks for keeping up and taking it down. Legiana does not spend much time on the ground during this fight unless it is tired or has been weakened enough. When going into the battle, it's best to bring along weapons that allow for higher mobility for the hunter and have attacks that allow easy mounting, such as the Insect Glaive. This weapon allows the hunter to move and dodge quickly while the weapon is drawn, has specific attack combos to easily get on top of the monster, and can hit Legiana while it is up in the air by the use of the Kinsect. Using any means to knock the monster back down to the ground before fighting it gives the hunter a big advantage. Legiana prefers to fight while it is in the air, making it tricky to find opportunities to attack. When the monster first takes off, it will usually try to attack the hunter with the massive claws on its legs. Legiana will turn towards the target and swipe at the ground in front of it, usually chaining this attack two or three times in a row. Getting behind the monster's legs and attacking during this animation is a good way to get in some free damage. Now comes the real fun, Legiana's Ice Elemental Attacks. Both of these attacks look similar, so watch for small differences to know exactly where to dodge out of the way. First, Legiana will flap its wings forward and turn its body slightly before whipping its tail around in a circle, launching a ring of ice in a circle around the monster and onto the ground. During this animation, dodge backwards away from the monster to get out of the area of the ring. Second, Legiana will spin quickly around in a circle in the air, then flap its wings hard while flicking its tail forward, shooting a blast of ice in a straight line in front of the target for a large distance. When the monster launches its spin animation, dodge to the left or right of where the monster is facing to get out of the way of the blast of ice and the ice trail that will be left behind. Getting hit by either of these attacks or standing on the ice trails too long will cause ice blight, which will put the hunter at a huge disadvantage until the ailment has passed. When the monster enters its enraged state, the hunter will notice its front area will frost over with small icicles. Not only will the monster get faster and hit harder, it will also add a flying charge attack to its ability roster. Legiana will pull back quickly when in the air, then straighten out flying forward while corkscrewing through the air directly at its target. When you see that animation of Legiana pointing its body in a straight line, try your best to dodge out of the way to the left or right as fast as possible before it gets to you. While Legiana is in its enraged state, it will attack very quickly and chain attacks together constantly. The best way of dealing with this is to kite the monster around the area as much as possible until it tires out and returns to its normal state. Legiana's ice elemental attacks will afflict the hunter with ice blight. Similar to water blight, the hunter will take a huge penalty to their stamina, causing it to deplete very quickly even when the stamina bar is full. Before going into battle, make sure to eat a meal that boosts elemental resistance, and make sure to take along a stack of null berries, which will remove the effects of ice blight immediately when consumed. The main areas on Legiana to focus on attacking are its head, wings, and tail. All three of these are breakable, but focusing on the tail and breaking it as soon as possible during the fight is very crucial. Once the tail has been broken, Legiana will no longer be able to freeze the surrounding terrain with its ice elemental attacks. The monster has two major elemental weaknesses. Thunder is the most damaging, followed by the fire element. Legiana is also very weak to the poison ailment, so having some poison smoke bombs handy is always a good idea when entering this fight. This encounter is fast paced and a ton of fun. It's great practice for any hunter learning to read body language to predict attack patterns and practicing how to mount monsters in various ways to knock them to the ground. Legiana really shows off the next generation feel of Monster Hunter World. And that's it! Gaming Instincts TV will be leaving you right here. Don't forget to like and subscribe if you enjoyed this video, and hit that notification bell to stay up to date and know when a new video is ready for your viewing pleasure. Also, check out our official website at GamingInstincts.com for latest daily news, featured articles, reviews, and more. Peace out everybody!